The date was December 3rd. Duke went into Madison and beat the Badgers 80 to 70 in the ACC Big Ten Challenge. They meet four months later. I would say the stakes are a little higher. I'm Jeff Fischel with Jason Capel. What's your prediction for Monday night's national championship? Tweet us at the ACCDN. Jason, one thing that sticks out for me from that matchup the first time around, Tyus Jones looked incredible, 22 points. Well, he dominated the guard position when you talk about making big plays down the stretch and also setting the table for his big guy inside. Tyus Jones made huge shots. When the game got tight, he made the drives to the basket and the ones knocked down clutch threes, but he also made sure that Quinn Cook got his points and he established a big fella inside until he all for He was the key to the Blue Devils winning their first true road game of the season, especially for those young guys. That's right. Making a big point of that, the freshman yeah. went out the road had a big win and Jaleel Okafor did get 13 points in only 27 minutes yeah. he was hindered a little bit by foul trouble well he was but the minutes that he got he produced he scored 13 points he got Frank Kaminsky in some foul trouble as well man in the inside in the paint but he also makes life easier for everyone else when you look at Quinn Cook 13 points knocking down timely baskets he cleared the lane for some of those Tyus Jones drives but we also look at Duke's bench Marshall Plumlee and Emil Jefferson stepped up in his absence and gave them quality minutes as well. Now it's interesting to me, two guys who didn't produce that night who are now playing major roles for yeah. their teams. <laughs> Justice Winslow and Sam Decker. Well, you talk about Justice Winslow and Sam Decker. These two guys have helped themselves when you talk about the NBA draft boys more than anybody in this tournament. But more importantly, they've gotten their teams to the point of playing for a national championship. Very similar players. You look at Decker, he's a little bigger at 6'9", but they're slashes. They like to attack the basket, put a lot of pressure on the defense by going off the bounce. They're tough, they're rugged. These are two guys that do a little bit of everything to help their teams win. Going to be a heck of a matchup on the wing. They do a little bit of everything, but they only each scored five points five, yeah. that night. It's pretty incredible. All right, what's your prediction for the game Monday night? Tweet us at the ACCDN. Hey, look, Duke beat Michigan State the first time by 10. They went out and beat the Spartans in the Final Four by 20. They beat Wisconsin by 10 back in December. What happens this time? You're watching the ACC Digital Network, brought to you by Ruby Tuesday. We are the official home for ACC basketball. For more great content like you've just watched, click one of these boxes. And to make sure you don't miss anything, click subscribe.